Agents were back out at a Phoenix business that deals with body parts. The owners are accused of selling those body parts on the black market. Federal government and the state attorney general's office are all involved in this. Mike Walkus joins us live with the latest on what they found out there today. Mike? Uh, yeah, Carrie, the Arizona Attorney General's Office today setting up a telephone number for people to call whose loved ones' bodies may have been donated here to the Biological Resource Center. We're going to have that phone number for you in just a moment. But today, here at the business, state and federal investigators, as you can see, once again busy executing a search warrant. They were wheeling out gurneys carrying what appeared to be body bags today at a Phoenix business called Biological Resource Center. The bags, at least nine, then loaded into three vans from Dignity Memorial. This as state and federal investigators armed with a search warrant continued to rake through the business for a second day. It's federal and state cooperation between the Attorney General's office and the FBI, yes. And you're targeting that business? Correct. Biological Resource Center billing itself on the internet as a whole body donation program and qualified tissue bank. A place where people can basically arrange to donate their body after they're dead. Biological Resource Center connects those who wish to donate their body to science with medical research and education facilities. According to sources, the Phoenix probe linked to an investigation in Detroit where a warehouse reportedly full of body parts of as many as 1,000 people was raided recently. That investigation reportedly focusing on the alleged illegal sell and trafficking of body parts. No answer today at the home of Stephen Gore, owner of Phoenix's Biological Resource Center. But at his business today, the doors once again propped open as investigators continued to remove evidence. Yeah, and that phone number set up by the Attorney General's office for people who may have had loved ones whose bodies were donated to this facility, that number you can call 602-542-8888. We understand that you will get a recorded message, they'll get some information from you, and then an investigator will be in contact. Obviously, lots of people potentially very concerned about this, and still lots of unanswered questions. We're going to continue to monitor, and we'll have the answers as soon as we know. We're going to have more on this story coming up at 530. Throw it back to you.